Hello everyone and welcome back to another DaVinci Resolve 18. In this lecture, I want to show you guys how to make the perfect slow motion in DaVinci Resolve. And so a couple of things you need to check first before proceeding to slowing down your clip. The first thing is the timeline. Okay, so if I click here, you can see that we're working on a 23 or let's say 24 frames per second timeline. And the video clip is 60 frames a second okay so the first rule here is that you have to make sure that the frame rate of the clip is higher than the frame rates of the timeline okay otherwise it's not going to be a perfect slow motion it's just going to be you slowing down the clip and you know the results may not be as cool as doing it the right way or the clip the playback of the slow motion may not play smooth as doing it the right way so now I'm going to take my 60 frames clip that I shot with my phone and put it here and let's just play it real quick. So now what I'm going to do is right click on the clip and then we're going to look for change clip speed. Okay. Now here is the trick. What is the optimum speed to slow down this clip? Okay. And the way we do that is that we divide the frame rate of the timeline by the frame rates of the clip. So 24 divided by 60 is 0.4, which means we're going to slow this down to 40%. Okay. And then change. Now, if I click on play, Okay, you can see that it's running smooth. If you had a better camera, I'm just shooting this with my phone. But if you had a better expensive camera, you can see that you will obtain much better results. The more frames you have, the better and the more professional the slow motion will look. For me personally, if I'm looking for this perfect slow motion, I would shoot at 120 frames per second and then divide 24 by 120 and adjust the slow speed but my phone can only shoot at 60 frames a second and this is all we're working with right now okay so if you have any question make sure you leave it in the comments thank you for watching and if you're looking for any premium courses make sure you check my skillshare profile